thanks, and giving. So it's Thanksgiving Day 2021. I woke up alive. I had to shave. I blew some leaves off the steps and headed for the train. It's good to take a day to pause. I'm not sure it's necessary to gorge. I think we would do just as well to have a normal meal and take a few moments to dwell on our everyday blessings. But I get the idea of having a feast. You invite over relatives and friends and their beasts. People bring pies and things that use butter instead of yeast. Sometimes someone says a prayer. Maybe you invited the priest. I'd like to step back far enough to see that I live like a prince or a king from history. An indoor toilet and hot running water, vitamins and supplements, and a person who cleans my teeth. I'm really at the top of the heap, and I know it. A big thank you to all my ancestors who entrusted me with their genes and for all of your sweat so I could have a bed in this blessed and bedeviled land. Has it all gone to plan? Have some reckoning to do. I must play my part too. I'm in the beauty and delight department. I'm not smart enough to deal with truth and facts. I know it's not enough to think your heart is in the right place, but if your art is, uh, maybe you are too. Anyway, I'm grateful that you're here to hear me, on the scene to see me, got the soul to feel me, and a fingertip and a finger to tip me with a like. I'm happy to get to do this while it isn't all bliss. I know I'm better off than I've earned. Life is like that. An equal distribution of privilege and gifts and opportunities. So I take a keto pause, eat a pumpkin slice or more and say it's all a miracle even without cranberry sauce. Amen. And now we bring the sappy music in for a close. No one cuts off the flautist. You can go. I'll be here a minute. That was that was it. it was a rising note. Okay, bye. Yellow is not my color. <laughs>